Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. This question comes from Nick, who is still in the process of analyzing the PS3 and the Xbox 360. He says, I want to be sure to buy the right system for me. Still, I don't really understand how it works for online content for both systems. I mean, technically speaking, how can I go online with my PS3 or Xbox 360? Do I have to plug in an Ethernet cable to my internet modem, which provides access to internet, my local internet service, near my computer? I don't understand how to plug my new console when I'll get one so that I can access to live content. Well, grammatical issues aside, uh, you could connect your console either directly to your internet connection or to a router which is connected to your internet connection or, is the case in both the PS3 or the Xbox 360, use a wireless connection. But if your internet modem doesn't have a wireless access point, again, you'll need to go through some kind of wireless router. Um, bottom line, uh, if you don't have any kind of connectivity anywhere near the machine, you'll have to go wireless. The PS3 does come with a wireless controller, and I'd almost expect that for the price that you'd pay for a PS3 compared to an Xbox 360. With an Xbox, you'll have to purchase a separate controller that plugs into the back and that has an antenna that will allow you to connect to A, B, or G wireless networks. Now, as far as the online content's concerned, um, you know, you may want to do your homework and, and find out which particular universe of content you would more appreciate. Uh, so if it happens to be the Xbox Live Marketplace and the games inside there, or the content that the Xbox Live Marketplace has inside compared to the co online content that Sony has. Uh, apples and oranges, quite honestly, uh, but that being said, I think that the Xbox and Microsoft universe, in terms of online game playing, in terms of online management, uh, in terms of content, really, I, I, honest, Microsoft's got a leg up on Sony in so many ways. Now, that's just my personal opinion. Uh, someone says you'll have to spend more money on Xbox 360 accessories. Xbox equals better network. Save your money and play pa Plasma Pong. Woohoo! For the win, Plasma Pong. I'm a recent addict to that game. I haven't networked Plasma Pong with Ponzi. Ooh, there's a little bit of alliteration for you. Uh, I'm smarter than a fifth grader. Uh, PS3, uh, free online network. The network is the same. It's the integration that differs. Very true. Uh, Plasma Pong at eight frames a second isn't for the win. That is also very true. Uh, you know, in, in thinking about the online content in both uh, universes, you may also find out what your friends are playing. So if most of your friends are using and playing on the PS3, then that's probably what you're going to go with as well, because none of your friends would be on the Xbox 360, because that universe doesn't get along with the PS3 universe. On the other hand, if more of your friends are on the Xbox 360, that would be the platform that I would push you towards, because playing online and you're not playing with friends... No, I mean, there's something to be said about meeting people, playing online games, some people that I'd never want to meet in person or online. Uh, but, you know, getting online and knowing what your friends are playing and, 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 you know, matching against them and playing specifically with those friends, it's, it's a lot of fun. And if, if you're not engaging in that kind of experience, uh, you, you are missing out with a lot of what online gaming is, and that is camaraderie. Uh, there is smack talking, of course, going on. Uh, but anyway, I have an Xbox 360 and get 8, something wrong there a lot. Not sure I understand what that was just trying to state, but anyway, there's the bottom line. You can connect either wired or wirelessly to either system. Uh, it may cost you extra in some cases with the Xbox 360. Uh, I think it does boil down to what kind of content you like and what your friends are already using.